Have you ever found yourself struggling to format a date string in your code? It can be a real headache, especially when things don't go as planned. If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're diving into how to format a date string with a dot in the time zone value into an NS date object. I totally get it. It's frustrating when you think you have a simple task, but it turns into a puzzle. You're not alone in this. Many developers face similar issues when dealing with date formatting. Let's look at the specific question at hand. One user asked, how do I format a date string like 2017-06-04-600-Z into an NS date object? They mentioned that the dot in the time zone is causing issues, and despite trying various format strings, they keep getting nil in Xcode. Sound familiar? Let's work through this together. So, what's the deal with this date string? The issue arises because the standard date format doesn't recognize the dot in the time zone. This can lead to confusion and errors when trying to convert it into an NS date object. But don't worry, we'll break it down step by step. And stick around. I have a special tip at the end that will help you avoid these formatting headaches in the future. To format the date string correctly, the user should start by creating an instance of NS date formatter. This will allow us to specify the format of the date string we are working with. Next, the user needs to set the date format for the NS date formatter. Since the date string contains a dot in the time zone, we will use a specific format that accommodates this. Now, the user can convert the date string into an NS date object. This is done by calling the date from string method on the NS date formatter instance. Finally, the user should check if the NS date object is not nil. If it is nil, this indicates that the date string could not be parsed correctly. Fun fact, did you know that the concept of time zones was only introduced in the late 19th century? Before that, every city had its own local time. Imagine trying to coordinate meetings back then. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution provided by another user involves using Objective-C to format the date string. They suggest using the date format YYMMDDTMNH8SSSZ for the string 27 tas 604 6 format the ZILZ. This will successfully create an NS date object. For local time conversion, they recommend using YYYMMDDSSSZ. Additionally, they provide a format for a different st string structure, YYYMMTHSSSZ, for strings that include more precision. Now, let's see a response from a different user. An alternative solution from another user suggests simplifying the date string by removing the dot and the time zone part. They recommend using a date formatter with a specific format and setting the time zone to GMT. Here's the tip I promised. Always ensure your date strings are in a consistent format before trying to convert them. This will save you a lot of time and frustration. And there you have it. You should now be able to format your date string into an NS date object successfully. Remember, consistency is key when dealing with date formats. If you found this video helpful, hit that subscribe button for more tips and don't miss our next video where we tackle more coding challenges.